Hi guys, Lizard Noah of SUVs.com here, back with another two minute review because I recently had the chance to check out the new Land Rover Defender, another iconic vehicle that has been reimagined as that seems to be the trend these days. And I want to make sure I thank Jaguar Land Rover of Cherry Hill. The reimagined Defender still has that instantly recognizable silhouette. Take a look at all the horizontal and upright surfaces, the advanced round headlamps, and the cool side hinge tailgate with that exposed spare tire. This is a four-door 110 and it's a first edition. There's also the two-door Defender 90 to consider. There are cool exposed features inside and you have this magnesium beam here with integrated grip handles that runs the width of the dash. Take notice of the command driving position. It's excellent for viewing the road ahead. There's also lots of advanced technology. There's a new infotainment system with a 10-inch touchscreen, and you have the digital instrument cluster with integrated navigation. This first edition model features a panoramic sliding roof that's just wonderful. The 90 model is available with a full-length soft top that allows passengers to stand in the second row when it's parked for that true safari feel. The two-door model also comes standard with a jump seat up front here so that you can fit six. You could opt for it in this 110 or also go for the optional 5 plus 2 seating. This is a highly capable off-road vehicle with a ground clearance of 11.5 inches and permanent four-wheel drive. While the standard engine is plenty potent, there's also this even more powerful 3-liter turbocharged six-cylinder with a mild hybrid system that delivers 395 horsepower. Recap and rating time now. I love the exterior, 9.5. Interior is also great, but slightly short on cargo space, so a 9. Performance and off-road ability is wonderful, 9 there as well. Fuel economy is what you'd expect, 7.5. And, and overall value, I'll rate at a 9 as it starts at 49,900, and it's truly a special vehicle to have. And that results in an SUVs.com deal score of 88 out of 100. What do you think about the new Defender? Let me know in a comment below.